Hey, royal family. What y'all doing? Hey, happy, happy Friday. Yay! All right, you guys. I am back. Today is Friday, and I told you that I was going to do us a Super Bowl snack. I went through all the lists. Dips, chips, wings, burgers, fries, you know, loaded fries, loaded potatoes. And guess what Miss O came up with? <laughs> I'm going to tell you guys, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of old, but I don't know if you guys remember this. Some of you might. My mom used to fix hot link chili dogs. Oh, yeah. And when I tell you they were so delicious, I decided, okay. For my Super Bowl snack, we're going to do Hot Lynx Chili Dogs. Oh, yeah. It's going to be fire. Trust me. I've tried out the Lynx. Oh, they're wonderful. And they're beef Hot Lynx, by the way. And we're going to do no homemade, I mean, no canned chili. We're literally going to do homemade chili. Of course, turkey but it's still going to be homemade chili. And it's gonna be your basic chili. Uh, we won't put any beans. We're not gonna put any onions. I know you're like, seriously, and you're doing the chili? Because we're gonna to top the dogs off with the onions, the cheese, the jalapenos. And then even on the tray, I'm going to give you a choice of beverage. All right, I want to say thanks to all of my new subscribers. Thank you guys so much. Thank you for commenting, and thank you for liking my videos. And my ride or die, you know who you are. You guys rock. Don't forget to go check out that boy. He can cook, y'all. He can cook, y'all. All right, enough jibber-jabbering. Let's get ready to make these hot link. All right, here are our ingredients. This is a pound of ground turkey. I think it's 93% lean and 7% fat. You want that in a chili. Even if you're doing ground beef, you want a lean ground beef for your chili. And this is a pound. Um, if you were doing normal chili, I would say use a pound and a half. But since we're making this into chili dogs, let's just go with a pound, okay? Here I have tomato paste. It always makes your chili really rich. Always remember that tomato paste will give you a very thick and hearty chili. All right? Here... We have onion powder, we have garlic powder, we have ground cumin, we have smoked paprika, we have sea salt. Again, I like my trusty old soy sauce, soy sauce, less sodium. I'm going to be using beef broth instead of chicken to make it a little more hearty. Uh, of course, we have our black pepper and our chili powder. And the star of the show is da -da -da -da, our beef hot links. Now, I don't know, can you guys see that? See, I've already tested one. And let me tell you what I found is good. Most of the time, I don't like boiling like weenies or bratwurst or anything like that because it kind of takes the flavor out for me. But for these, we're going to boil them in water. I find out the texture is better 
And when you put chili over it, oh my Lord, it takes it to another level. And of course, I will have all of the uh, ingredients in the description box below and the measurements of the seasoning. But always remember, I'm going to start you out with the seasoning. Then you add to your desired taste. All right, let me get this beef ground up. Not beef, let me get this turkey browned up. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. All right, I have the turkey in the uh, skillet to brown. We're going to go ahead and add our seasonings. As I stated before, I always like putting my seasonings together. That way, you'll get even distribution when you do that. So if you combine it all together and then put it on your meats, you'll get an even distribution. But I'm going to let this brown up and then I'll come back because I don't want to hold you guys with you just watching uh, the meat brown. But as soon as it browns, I'll come back. All right, Royal, you see the meat is cooked. What we're going to do, we're going to put a tablespoon of the tomato sauce in the middle. And we want to kind of bloom it. That means to bring uh, the flavor out. So I said a, a teaspoon, I mean a tablespoon. Let's do a heaping tablespoon of tomato paste. Of course, I'll probably have to get my fingers in there. All right. And it's just, we're just going to, we're not going to mix it in the meat. We're just going to let it uh, kind of sit here for a moment. And then we'll put it all together. And you can also, uh, if any of it stays on your, uh, on your spoon, uh, once you put your uh, beef broth in or your chicken broth, you can uh, rinse the uh, portion off. So let's let this sit here for about two minutes. I've already added my seasoning. It is seasoned to perfection. So I'm going to give you the exact measurements. All right. So give me two minutes. We'll come back and we're going to mix it all together. We're going to put it on low and let it simmer for about 45 minutes to an hour. All right. Be right back. All right. Let's get her going. So here's the tomato uh, paste. So we had it intensified the flavor on that. Let's get our beef broth. And I'm going to try to measure it, you guys. I really am. So I am going to say this is two cups of beef broth. Next, we're going to add soy sauce and at the end I might add a little cayenne pepper okay let's give this two teaspoons okay that's two teaspoons of soy sauce now let's stir this up and this liquid is going to reduce and really intensify this chili all right, we're going to add a tablespoon and a half of chili powder. Now, you know the chili powder, chili powder gives it that nice darkness. You see there? You see how it changed? And that's it. That's all. So we're going to put this on low for about an hour. Then when I come back, I am going to present to you my Super Bowl platter. And also, I'm going to go ahead and uh, get the hot links 
uh, after 45 minutes, then I'll start uh, boiling the hot links. All right, you guys, I'm excited to show you guys the finished presentation. All right, Ross, here is the finished product of the presentation of the hot link chili dogs. I cut up some onions, jalapenos, I put some spicy funyuns and regular potato chips. I also gave you three choices. You could have a beer, wine, or a soda. Uh, and this is just, I thought, a really cool football uh, platter that I had got maybe a couple of years ago. But anyway, I'm going to come back and eat with you guys. So hang tight. All right, you guys, I want you to see these chili dogs. Can you see them? The hot link chili dogs. I hope uh, you can see them pretty well. All right, I'm gonna take a bite and let you guys see the insides of these babies. Now it might get a little messy, all right? So don't talk about me. All right, here we go. Let me show you. Cheers. Look at that. Yep, it's getting messy. All right, I'm going in. Hang on. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Look at that hot link, you guys. Can you see that? And the chili is phenomenal. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm trying to eat too fast. But again, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for taking the time out of your time to watch my videos. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out That Boy Can Cook. All right, I'm gonna give you one more, one more shot. Look at that hot link. You guys, you have to try it with the hot link. And until we meet again, one more bite. All right, one more. I promise, just, just one more. Mm. Remember. Always put God first in anything you do. Yum, yum. Goodbye.